created it, you can also fix it. Dan Selleck is also using technology to fill a need, which is adult students on the autism spectrum. We want to be the apple of autism. He's teaching them to code, write apps, and make a living in the tech industry. If you want to know a terrorist, find out that your child has a disability. As a parent, we're all asking the same question. What happens after we're gone? The unemployment rate for the almost half a million autistic adults is startling. The standard is about 90% of individuals on the autism scale who are adults are either unemployed or underemployed. It's very limited in the number of job opportunities individuals with autism have. The pay is simply uh, very poor if they get paid at all. Dan Selleck is on a mission to change that, creating a non Pharrell Institute based just outside of Dallas, Texas. Today, we'll take you inside his hybrid school meet tech company for an intimate look at his revolutionary solution to empower adults on the autism spectrum all over the world. I'm Dr. Sanjay Gupta, and this is The Next List. Non-parel means a person or thing so excellent as to have no equal or match. And that really comes from how we as parents think about our kids. Today, we're competing in several marketplaces. We compete in the iTunes Store and Google Play and, and most of the mobile platform stores. Uh, we, we even have some product in, in iBooks. This story is just mainly about one spirit that represents both good and bad until it separates into two. Nonpro Institute is a place where we take adults in the autism spectrum and we provide them technology training, uh, they learn to work on teams, and ultimately we have a living campus vision where they'll come together and live. I'm a 3D modeler and animator, and basically make sure to make the stuff, well, physically be there and make it move. We are a nonprofit. We're funded uh, largely by our student fees, by the support we get from the donor community, but ultimately uh, it's about fulfilling lives. For me, and probably a lot of people, they never expect to make video games. They might be lucky enough to just get, you know, a janitor's job like I had for a few years, and then just going from that to this. That's just a miracle for a large group of people like us. Autism is a developmental disorder that's typically characterized by three types of impairments. One's a uh, social impairment, uh, the second is a communication impairment, and then the third is typically described as repetitive or repeated behaviors. Some people pace and they get a little nervous, and some people uh, cough or, or have ticks, and for that reason may not be able to maintain a job. This population faces challenges in a way that makes it difficult for corporate America to easily accommodate their needs. Business is business. Nonpareil is a company that exists to serve the needs of its employees. You could be working on the uh, applied textures. The learning process here is, is directed towards removing the negatives. This is our cloud-based engagement application called MP Connect. It's a piece of software that I wrote that really allows us to um, better engage our students in both training and from the production standpoint. We just have a ton of training resources that you can go look at. Many, many videos, PDF files, lots of information that as a team we've gathered over time. So when you've kind of gone through all of the training and all of the courses, you begin to get assignments in campaigns. And campaigns are products that's going to market. Each of these individuals comes into our program and is able to experience these great tools that allow them to innovate and take these great creative ideas and turn them into content that they can share with the world. The four games we have on the iTunes store right now are NPI Sorabon, NPI Card Track, NPI Tap It, and NPI Space Aid. Whitewire is a game that's coming up and Docs and Boxes uh, is another game that's coming up. My name is Aaron Winston. I've been non pro for over two and a half years. This is Space Ape on the Ouya console. My 
I decided I wanted to uh, learn how to be a programmer. So about like a year and a few months ago, I took the C-Sharp 101 course, and since then I've just been programming a lot. That's really the difference in our model, is that we don't just provide training. In the end, they become part of a working software company. And today we're competing in the mobile marketplace. Aaron has been at Nonpareil for about two and a half years. And the changes are unbelievable. I mean, he's always was bright. Now he's got something that really captivates his mind, that he's like really into and like really enjoys learning or digging for the answers. It is very personal. It's very emotional. We have days that are pretty full and there's a lot of ups and downs. Mostly all good. Up next, the personal reasons for Dan Selleck's extraordinary school. Okay, love. Can you turn around and say hi? Say hi, camera. Okay, and later. Brought to you by Meineke Car Care Center. Getting your car serviced at Meineke. Smart. Saving time by booking an appointment. Say hi, camera. Hey, camera. <laughs> I have three boys. My youngest is on the spectrum. And looking at him and his abilities, he had technical abilities that my other two boys didn't have. And for me, I wanted Caleb to have a chance to to live a fulfilled life, not just live a life. He loves technology. Uh, put him in front of a PC, he's happy. Do you love making videos? Yeah. Yeah? What are some of your characters' names? Have you made your own characters? I have made a character called Keith. It turns out that there's a whole population of this group that this is their core strength. They're digital natives. Tell me some of your other characters' names. We're done. Oh, are we done? Yeah. Okay. Well, <laughs> thanks, thanks for talking, okay? When I recognized that my son needed answers for his life, I began with the business model, that, that there needs to be something structured around this that can be deployed not only locally but worldwide. non Institute is about hope. I think that all of Dan's work is disruption in how we view human capital. Dan's taking some of these really incredible individuals and giving them an environment to be successful in. And so it's a very disruptive process to how he's growing his organization. This is the kitchen where it all started. A year and a half or so, you know, I ran the business out of the kitchen and, and this is where the two training stations were set up. And uh, every night, five nights a week, um, for over a year, uh, two students would show up each night, and uh, I would work a full day job and then come home and do two sessions. We've been open about two and a half years, and we have trained quite a few kids. Right now, we have 115 students enrolled at Don Perel, and we think we can get to 125 on this at this location. So we're looking to add about 10 more students, just like anybody else. They are looking for purpose in life. They're looking to find meaning for their life. The long-term goal is to provide a campus community where they can train, they can work, and they can also live. So let's Minecraft build up. Minecraft, nice. My name is Rachel Bowles, and I've been non-parallel since 2012. In January, when the New Year world ran, I just said one more prayer and said, God, please just help us find something for Rachel. Many of them have lost confidence, lack self-esteem. Uh, they've been bullied in life. They've been, they've failed in college or in employment. Everyone on the east side of town has known Rachel to be the girl that skates all over the place. And I would just think, oh, I'm the worst parent in the world. I can't keep my 34-year-old daughter from skating all over town because she has nothing else to do. And yet, I couldn't offer her, I couldn't find her something else to do. Well, they come here, and within weeks or months, they begin to see that this is something they can do. They fit in. They're accepted here. I got a job, too, as a lab assistant in a lab room, helping people out with their hammer or their quest, or if they have a problem with their, what they're working on. So I never thought I would get a job that quick working here.
ambition to become an innovation factory for, uh, for approaching the marketplace and giving our crew sustainable revenue in the future. The non parallel model was very viable um, for a specific portion of the population. Now, Rachel, I've seen uh, her work and, and she's excited about having done that and about what comes next and what she might try out next. I think the notion, like to me, to our family, we are so grateful to non parallel and what it has given to us. And just the idea that there's no dollar amount for that. Don Corral currently has a waiting list of people from all over the world. They all want to be a part of Dan Selleck's unlikely school. And he plans on expanding, first in Texas, then around the country, and eventually around the world. Our next